the Motorola Crazer K1. What's catchy about this phone is its build quality. The device looks and feels great because it gives a solid impression without it being too heavy. Ang kabuong sukat nito ay 16 by 42 by 103 millimeters at may bigat na 103 grams. Dahil slim na slim ang katawan nito, madaling i-grip at i-flip open gamit lang ang isang kamay. Looking at its mirror finish front spine, the K1 is coated in highly reflective dark blue plastic with a glass inset. Although, although the glass inset is really attractive, it's a magnet for ugly, for ugly fingerprints. However, ang good news naman ay it's scratch resistant. It actually, it actually feels robust. Ang likod nito ay rubber finish kaya naman madali pa ding hawakan at hindi madulas. Under its electric blue mirror, in front is its 2 megapixel camera and at the middle is the 96 by 80 resolution screen display. This secondary screen displays the time and date, network and battery status, and the wallpaper in the background. On the bottom edge of this spine is the speaker grill that is hardly noticeable. Sa side panel makikita ang shortcut keys. Sa kaliwa ay ang volume at smart key. Kapag naka-close, the smart key serves as a camera key. Pero kapag naka-open, it can serve as any application you desire. The back spine is occupied by its other speakers sa bandang ibaba at battery cover sa bandang itaas. Sa ilalim ng cover na ito, may kita ang memory stick at ang battery. Opening the back cover is a breeze. Just push the metal plate on the upper part of the back panel and gently slide it, slide opening, opening it up. Kung ibabalik naman ay ganito. Opening the handset will reveal a keypad quite similar to the old Razer. Bad trip nga lang dahil andyan pa din ang flat keypad na patuloy na nagpapahirap sa user pagkapa, sa pagkapa ng key kung hindi tinitignan. Although mas umokay dahil sa rubber ridge outlining the numbers on the keys at ang evenly sized keys ay less confusing. Ang mga keypad nito ay may, ay may blue backlight kaya madaling gamitin kahit pa madilim. Its backlight doesn't impede visibility when used in bright areas or daylight time. It has no light sensor, that's why it automatically it doesn't automatically turn off the backlight when it's bright. The Moto Crazer K1's interface is just the same with the old interface Motorola is using. Kahit pa maging sa features nito, wala namang ipinagbago tulad lang din ng Razer. Easy to navigate at intuitive. Moto Crazer is an elegant clam phone as, Motor as Motorola claims. True as it is, the Motorola Crazer is an elegant clam phone. That's it. Nothing much to be excited about.